Abiyato State People's Democratic Party has expressed shock over the destruction of property at Benin Airport and the death of a police officer, Inspector Ono Ako, who was attacked to the All Progressive Congress candidate, Senator Monde Upibolo. The party chairman, Dr. Tony Ezekbemi, accused of the violence of being orchestrated by APC thugs to enforce the Abuja Federal High Court judgment that reinstated or impeached Deputy Governor of Edo State, Comrade Philip Shaibu. He called for full investigation. The Edo State chapter of the People's Democratic Party expresses deep shock over the wanton destruction of properties and the death of a police officer as a result of the violence orchestrated by thugs of the APC under the guise of enforcing the Abuja Federal High Court judgment that reinstated the impeached deputy governor of a good state. It is quite disheartening that an innocent police officer lost his life due to the violence unleashed on innocent citizens by the APC led by his community candidate, Senator Monday Opel. The PDP expresses deep sorrow over the death of this gallant officer. We commiserate with the family of the deceased and pray that our good Lord grants him eternal rest and the family the fortitude to bear the irreparable loss. We call on the security agencies to thoroughly in-depth analysis of the incident that happened yesterday at the Benin Airport. We urge the police, the security agencies, to carry out an autopsy on the body of the fallen hero. When they were coming, as at the time they said the police, the policeman, may so rest in peace, was shot. There were at least 20 mobile policemen in their convoy. And they saw from where they were shot. So this is not a case of a sniper shooting someone. Why did they not retaliate? Somebody carries a gun and kills your colleague in your presence. And I was looking at the body of that person they paraded around town. His hands were put in his pocket, and I did not see blood. I want to urge our people not to be intimidated. Your votes will count. All they are trying to do now is to look at different ways to disenfranchise you. We urge the Commissioner of Police to please ensure that a complete forensic investigation is done as to how that policeman died. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.